What's up, Quark out the fans, HangerDrone.com. Today I'm going to be flying my, v or my uh, Tarantula X6 JJRC H16. Um, I just put a new flight controller in there and flight uh, circuit board. Uh, it took a little bit of work. I had to reverse a few wires. Um, it didn't come with any wires, so I had to put the old ones on there. So we're airborne. Um, feels like something's off with the possibly one of the channels could be off. It's uh, pitching back towards me. So, it seems to be handling okay now. My rudder seems to be really struggling here. It's handling pretty responsive from my ailerons left to right. It's my rudders that seem to be having the issue. hit myself in the head there. So as you can see it's uh, got this backward slant to it. I don't know if it was just taking off on an uneven surface that could have caused that. <laughs> Flip button's working. Did that a little too close. So something appears to be off, but it is airborne, so the motors are spinning in the correct direction. Just uh, seems to be a little bit of an issue with the feedback. That yaw rate is very, very slow. Could be a lot faster than that. Seems like it's struggling a little bit, so my goal of trying to salvage this thing was to um, possibly put the run cam on it. So we'll turn the speed up a little bit and see if that helps out. So in the higher mode, it seems to be handling better. And something about the slow mode. And it could be I uh, just not used to flying the JJRC H16. It is a little bit touchy. The right stick and doesn't seem to be centering so. All the trims are at zero, so we'll take it out and you can see it's cruising like a rocket, so um, the all rate seems to be fine. There's a lot of dirt and grime and it's been sitting for a month waiting for the uh, control board to get here. I'd order from China. I just hope my solder job would have been decent enough. It seems like it is. All the lights are functioning correctly. I didn't uh, put the top light in there. It was the only one that I missed. I lost the wire for that. So, In the fast mode, it seems to be handling fine. So, tarantula usually get anywhere between five to seven minutes of flight time. 
I don't have any landing gear on, prop guards on. So, uh, we have to do a soft belly landing. Rain seems to be okay. Other than this, this drift backwards, I'm really not quite sure what is going on there. I'll need to get a couple more flights in before I go ahead and put the, uh, run cam on it because this thing's, uh, still not responding the way I would like it to. So our yaw rate's back. It looks like it possibly just needed to get broken in. Like I said, there was a bunch of grime in there. I tried to clean it out the best I could, but... And what's cool about the tarantula when you fly it at night is the, uh, two eyeballs in the front, they almost act like a spotlight on the ground. So, there's very little wind. And I'm gonna probably chalk it up to tilting backwards, possibly just to not taking off on an even surface. But right there, you know, it just kind of went crazy and jerked away in the opposite direction. So. There seems to be some sort of input errors. Not quite sure what it is at the moment. And like I said, I, I had to go back to my old photos and look at the board to realize that I had uh, to reverse a couple wires on the motors in order to get it to uh, spin in the correct direction. I didn't have the motor layout, so I just had to put the motors on, put the props on, put a piece of tape on there, watch which way they were spinning in order to figure out uh, which props to put where to get the proper lift, but we've got lift. We are flying, so that's half the battle. Um, I suck at soldering, so kind of pleased that it's working. Didn't know how it was going to go when I just received the the board with no wires, board with no wires attached to it. So I had to salvage all the wires off the old board and put them on. So we're probably going on four to five minutes of flight time here. And it's flying fast playing smooth, so we'll go ahead and crank it down to speed mode into the lower, slower mode. Now this is where it starts getting squirrely, which is odd. The input seem to be better on uh, the fast mode. Now the tarantula does have three modes on it. You have your low, you have your medium, and then you have your high rate of speed, which I typically fly in the high because uh, it feels better with the wind. This is a very light quadcopter. It's not quite a mini. It's almost a full size. It can lift the GoPro. Um, it's got a pretty decent sized battery on it. And if you don't have it weight, weighted down, you can get some good flight time out of it. It's got big motors gear driven, so that's why it is a little bit noisier. So I just had it, had it over rotate there on the yaw with the rudder, so that kind of leads me to believe that I'm um, getting a little bit of a signal error. Now when they send me this control board from, from China, it looks a little beat up. Looked like it possibly had some used parts on it. Had some bad soldering, not that my soldering is very good, but that's our indicator letting us know it's time to bring it in for a landing. So we'll try to do a hand landing if we can and catch it. So and the grass is wet and I didn't want to get it in the grass and possibly get the wires wet, but 
JJRC H16 tarantula battery mod in the back. Um, no landing gear on it. Test flight number one after redoing the uh, circuit board in there. That's my first real true quadcopter. It's been a great learner to learn on. Highly recommend it to anyone uh, looking to get one in that $50 to $60 range because, you know, like I said, this cam with the GoPro. I was excited to get the run cam because. Now I can actually put the run cam on this, and this should be able to lift it without an issue because I'm lifting the run cam with the smaller quadcopters, no problem. So um, I'll need to get this out in the daylight so I can monitor exactly what's going on. It's kind of hard to tell here at night, but just wanted to get a test flight in to make sure that the props are spinning in the right direction. I did was getting lift, which I did. Uh, so so far so good. And uh, if this video helped you out in any way, leave a like. If you have questions or comments, put them in the section below, and I'll try to answer them whenever I can.